Sidney Pollock's classic 1975 political thriller Three Days of the Condor is a roller coaster from start to finish. CIA analyst Joe Turner's office is struck by a European hitman and his team of killers, leaving a half dozen dead, including Turner's girlfriend. As the plot unravels and the body count grows, the audience realizes a frightening truth. The hitmen weren't working against the CIA, they're working for it. When Condor learns the truth and takes his story to the New York Times, it seems he's won. But the CIA boss then asks the million dollar question. How do you know they'll print it? Viewers are left unsure and this is when the terrifying nature of the deep state becomes clear. The true terror isn't that invisible factions within the government will act criminally, it's that they'll never be held accountable, even when they're caught. We've seen Operation Paperclip, MK Ultra, MK Delta, Operation Mockingbird, the Pentagon Papers, Watergate, false flag attacks at the Gulf of Tonkin and Bay of Pigs, decades of supplying drug cartels with money and guns, torture assassinations, and, and who knows what else. Three Days of the Condor is a chilling reminder that it's not crazy to distrust the government, it's crazy not to.